India's chief badminton coach Pulela Gopichand has said that the shuttlers are working hard for the Rio Games. A total of seven Indian shuttlers, including London Olympic bronze medalist Saina Nehwal, have qualified for the Rio Olympics and their competitors will be decided in the draw which will be out on July 26th. I've got with me somebody who is not as a player but as a coach also has been par excellence. Somebody who has taken uh, badminton from, uh, uh, from its uh, recent heights. Uh, I have uh, Pulela Gopichand with me. Uh, let's talk to him about the recent uh, Rio Olympics and what chances India has in that. Uh, Gopichand, uh, we, were sending, we are sending probably the best team right now. Uh, last, year, last Olympic we have sent five member team, this time it's a seven member team. How do you rate India's chances? Well, I think uh, it's good that we have uh, some uh, new events also who have joined in like the men's uh, doubles and uh, two in the women's singles and I uh, hope that uh, this time we have a better chance, better medal prospects than we had in the last games. Um, the players have been working hard and each of these events, uh, whether it's the women's singles where we, I believe we have our best chances or the doubles and the men's singles, I think each of our events, it boils down to how well we are playing on a particular day and I'm sure that we'll be able to win. Kidambi Shrikant and uh, Sindhu uh, just didn't have a great year this time. Do you think their form is a worry, concern? Well, I think the last uh, tournament which was played, I think Shrikant reached the semi-finals and uh, I'm sure Sindhu's performances this year, although up and down, have also been some really good highs. She's beaten some top players and I hope that they, they culminate at the Olympics with some good performance. They're preparing well and uh, that's a good bonus uh, to expect that we have uh, a good chance at the Olympics. Right. Sina Nehwal's, uh, you know, sh you have seen her from a close quarter. How do you rate her chances? Well, I think uh, she's somebody who's been consistent in the last few years and uh, definitely the Australian Open will be a big confidence booster for us as the last tournament before the Olympics. Her winning will definitely be a confidence for her uh, to go into the Olympics. A lot of people are saying that, you know, SI, the sports ministry, everybody is talking about uh, having probably 15 medals or, you know, a double digit medal. How many medals as a coach, you know, are you expecting? Well, I think it will be difficult to say. All I only say is that the Sports Authority of India has really been supportive to the entire endeavour. And uh, I think congratulations uh, to the entire uh, Olympic um, support uh, team, uh, whether it's the government or the SAI um, and the associations. They have uh, ensured that the biggest contingents go from here to the Olympics. So one step is achieved. And I'm hopeful that uh, we'll um, cross the next bench and uh, get some more medals in all the games. You have seen the game change from, uh, you know, let's say, from your playing days to in 2016. How, how do you think that uh, Indian players have been coping well and how do you, how do you cope with that? Well, I think it's it's been good, and um, the sport has become bigger now than it has ever been in the past. And I believe that uh, with more performances from our players, it will get even better. Thank you so much for talking to us. So that was uh, Pulla Gopichan talking to us about uh, India's chances in the Olympics, and he is hoping that uh, this time India will get more medals in the competition. With cameraman Nair, this is Tapush Bhattacharya, DD News, Delhi.